Um, also, the WNBA kicked off their season um, yes, with a very powerful message to start the season. I also loved, um, again, them bringing awareness to social injustice, not forgetting about Breonna Taylor, making sure her name continues to circulate. We also saw the NBA players wear the WNBA uh, hoodies uh, yesterday as well, which was a great show of sign of unity. What are your thoughts on the start of that WNBA season and that powerful message that was delivered yesterday? Uh, I loved it. Uh, you saw I posted it on, on um, my Instagram yesterday. Uh, you know, I'm so happy. The, I think the, the ladies did an amazing job. Shout out to, to everybody in the WNBA. Um, you know, they, they're talking about keeping Breonna Taylor's name on the jersey for the entire season. Um, I would love that. Um, I, you know, I, it, it, it really, you know, it makes you feel good to know that, that these people, you know what I'm saying, that, I mean, realistically, they're basketball players at the end of the day. You know, so just the fact that, that this is what, what they want to do and they feel like this is what should be done. Um, they spoke so eloquently, um, you know, before the starts of, 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 those, of those games. And, you know, they, they're doing their part. The WNBA is definitely doing their part. Um, you know, I know we, we had the issue with uh, the Atlanta Dream uh, owner we spoke about a couple of weeks ago, um, you know, and how she felt. But the, the league showed how they felt this uh, opening weekend. And they went, you know, they went out there and they really represented for Brianna Taylor. But then, you know, for 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 the, the Black Lives Matter culture, we ain't, we ain't gonna say movement no more. LeBron told us there's ain't no movement. We are gonna say it for the culture, you know. And I and I love it, man. I love the I love what they did. I love what the NBA did, you know. And, and as well as the as Major League Baseball, which we're gonna get into a little bit later. Yeah, we, we'll definitely get into baseball. Um, I, I truly loved everything about what the WNBA showed, uh, what they presented to the fans, um, how they used their platform. Um, again, to continue to spread a much needed message. And I love the sign of unity from the NBA players. Uh, we see so many times that the NBA players come to the WNBA players defense and for them to wear the hoodies, you know, signifying we stand with you and this is their time now if they get their season started. I love it, man. Um, we've, we've been so vocal about the women um, getting, you know, an equal opportunity um, in whatever sense that may be. And so I love the fact that the, you know, Brianna Taylor's name is being displayed on the jerseys. And um, I, I just love it, man. Like I said, I, I can't think of another word I want to use there more than no, that. Because I just, I just, I really enjoy everything about it. It is, it is definitely fitting. Um, you know, I, I want to shout out Tobias Harris. Uh, you know, I posted that on, on my, my IG as well, you know, his press conference. And, uh, you know, basically he, just, he said, listen, any, any question you ask me, the answer is going to be, the killers of Breonna Taylor need to be brought to justice, you know? So I, I'm so happy with the players, you know, and again, because we, you know, we spoke a couple of weeks ago just about whether or not the season should be restarted because of everything that was going on. And, and we kind of came to the conclusion of, well, you know, a lot more can be done if sports, you know, on TV, if these guys are actually playing and we're seeing it, they're showing and proving uh, LeBron uh, with, with, the, with the sneakers. And him speaking up, Tobias Harris, all of these guys, all of these 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 ladies, they they are really showing up and they are showing out, and it's amazing. And I, I I'm I'm here for it, and I want to see more of it. I love it. Right. And and speaking of LeBron, we know um, obviously everything he's done um, to move the the culture forward. And as you said, lifestyle, not movement, uh, which is very important. Um, LeBron also helping out Florida, the state of Florida. Uh, with voting. Again, he continues to be at the forefront um, of activism as an athlete at, anyway, you know. Um, but I think too many times, and we've said it a lot of times, and I don't, I don't want to continue to repeat stuff we've used before or said before. Too many times people try to find ways to nitpick at LeBron. No matter what you think of LeBron, you can never question his intentions as a man. He is a great human being, and he continues to show us that again with his actions now as he helps out the, the voters of Florida. Oh no, that's 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 an absolute fact. Um, you know, he's he's helping uh, ex ex felons to uh to pay their court fees and whatnot so that they can vote. And uh, you know, you, you guys know that Florida is the state where you know you need that help the most. Each we you know a, a couple of elections, Florida's had uh, had some issues down there with their whole voting process. 
So, you know, it's definitely needed. I commend LeBron once again. You know, he 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 marches to the beat of his own drum, but he's gonna get to that to the to the conclusion that you know we feel like we need to be at, and that's what he did once once again. I mean, it, it, we're gonna start as, as LeBron being LeBron. That's that's what it is. This is what he does. He's gonna continue to do this. He needs to be a, you know applauded for for his actions because he truly he, he he walks the walk. He doesn't just talk the talk. He walks the walk. He's out there on the front lines doing what he can. And on top of that, he's still arguably the best player on the planet. Right. And and that's why I didn't understand the backlash of him not wanting to have a message or display someone else's name on the back of his jersey. Because he is one of the guys who truly lives that life and does these things. He's not just posting it for social media. He's not just entertaining the idea when it's popular. He does it all the time. And every time it's necessary, he shows up. So kudos to LeBron on that. Um, again, the, the season's about four days away from restarting. Of course, LeBron and the Lakers kick off against the Clippers. Yo, this is Teresa Weatherspoon, better known as Teaspoon, and you're watching Real Fans, Real Talk. Live from the can. Uh huh. This is Real Fans, Real Talk. Real Fans, Real Talk. We as real as you thought. Real